Oh, they're getting ready. Today is International Olympic Day, and believe it or not, we are 230 days away from the 2018 Pyeongchang Winter Games, and athletes are training all across the country. That's right, and you may not think of Arizona when you think of where Olympic bobsledders would train. Not at all. But that is exactly where one Olympic couple is doing just that, hoping to bring some gold home next year. Even in the scorching desert heat, these two are cool as ice. Oof. Alana Myers and Nick Taylor are focused, determined, and hardcore training in bobsled, all in the name of the Pyeongchang 2018 Winter Olympics, and they're doing it all right here in the Valley. So we have a long season in bobsled where we're cold all the time. <laughs> so being able to come out here and, you know, in other parts of the world, when we start out here in April and May, it is still snowing. There's snow all the way until June. So to be able to come out in Phoenix and do our running and our lifting and have these perfect conditions, you know, there's no rain, we're never missing any training. Um, so it's a really great atmosphere. But it's intense. It is here at EXO's Elite Training in Phoenix, where this sporting duo and married couple are preparing for their sport's biggest event. Alana already has two Olympic medals. Nick is chasing his first. No easy feat for this California boy. Constantly messing around. When just a few years ago, he was actually coaching track and field when one of his students, an Austrian, asked his help in bobsled training. In the middle of his tryout, he goes, hey, Coach Taylor, you're still in good shape. Why don't you just try out with me? Taylor did and made the world championship team, and the rest, as they say, is Olympic history. Now, this couple, married for three years, is going for the gold together. He knows what I'm thinking. He knows what I'm feeling. He knows me inside and out. So it's really helpful to have him behind me in the sled uh, because he can predict what I'm going through and make sure I'm taken care of and make sure I have everything what I need. I think he's going to bring it home with 10 again. I appreciate that belief, honey. Supporting each other through bobsled's grueling demands has been crucial. So you have to be able to run as fast as an Olympic sprinter downhill on ice with a 400 pound sled and then you jump in as fast as you can with three other people. So this power couple is powering through, reaching for that Olympic dream right here in our own backyard. So the people here in the valley are just so nice and friendly. You stop and just make friends. And they're also enjoying some of Phoenix's best grub. Hop Dottie, 100% Hop Dottie is the best burger in the world. Well, don't tell the coaches they have milkshakes as well. The milkshakes are so good. Also, you can't leave out Valley Luna. Valley Luna mini taco basket is <laughs> so dangerously delicious. Gotta earn that milkshake. Woo! Earn that Hop Dotties. <laughs> the coolest opportunity that Bobsled has uh, led me to was meeting my wife, who's sitting next to me here, Alana, which was what I was gonna say originally. Of course. <laughs> Good answer. Okay, really cool couple. Right? I mean, the fact that they are married and they're training together. Yes. Incredible. Well, by the way, Alana, she's already made the national team this year based on her standings last year, but nevertheless, it's so cool to have them here training yeah. and chasing their Olympic dreams right here in the Valley. And if your car breaks down, you better hope that he shows up. <laughs> He's the one you want to have around. push your car faster than you drive. Oh my but gosh. who knew there's so many people training for Winter Olympics curling. There's a big curling facility here, yeah. so a lot of people call this home for training. Exciting.